Hey guys, this is Nate Jackson. We're going to continue with the LinkedIn search feature. So, as I've said, we can let's go back here. Let's we can pick from people, jobs, companies, groups, universities, and posts. So, I'm going to show you how we can leverage groups because with groups, you have the ability to leverage your connections uh for anyone that you belong to anyone any person who's in the same group that you are you share a group you can message them just as you can message your contacts so i think that's a pretty important uh way place to start and the rest of them the rest of the features work the same as people in groups so once you know how to search for people in groups you can search for jobs companies universities or posts and we have all the same filtering options with all of the different categories so we're going to find uh, so we select the groups, uh, the groups selection, and then we're going to search for just a keyword. So if you want to search for groups about uh, marketing, and you can either pick groups about marketing or you can click the blue magnifying glass. I like to do the magnifying glass. Doesn't really matter. So we find 39,778 results for marketing. If you want to filter that down down just to English, you can do that. If you want to filter by a different language or you want to just pull your groups, you could do that. And there's more filters. Uh, well, these are just different categories, so you don't really want to do that if you're looking for groups. Advanced, what's here? Um, well, these are for different types of uh, categories, so I'd re recommend not messing with the filters if you're searching for groups. So we filtered it down to 31,051 results. I don't think you're going to get more than about, it's either 1,000 or 1,500. Uh, I'm not sure how many it's going to give you. And LinkedIn can be funny sometimes. Uh, sometimes, it'll, depending on how big your network is, that affects how many results they're going to let you have. Also, LinkedIn will, they, if you, you, you want to be, you don't want to just use it with reckless abandon. You want to space out your searches over, uh, not not just back to back to back because LinkedIn will take notice and uh, will uh, possibly uh, send you an email saying it looks like I, I've gotten an email when I was developing this software because I was doing so many searches. I got an email saying that uh, it looks like multiple people are using your account. And that was just from the volume of searches I was doing because I was doing so much testing over and over. And once when you when you use the software, really, you're going to do a search. And then you're going to have the data that you need. So you're not going to be doing back-to-back -back searches. Uh, because you do one search, you're going to be fine. You do a search per day, you're going to be fine. So anyway, so you have your search results. And the next thing we need to do is pick a file name. So we choose save file. And we're going to, I'm going to call this marketinggroups.csv. And with these results, you can find groups that you want to join. And uh, from there, once you join the groups, then you can post to the groups and you can also download the members of the groups that it gives you. And from once you download the members of the groups, then you can message those members because you can message any member in any group that you belong to. So that goes far, be far, much further beyond just your first level contacts. You can message any member of any group that you share a group with. So we, we do our keyword, pick our category, do our filter, and save a file name, and then click start. So we're going to click start, and the software is going to do its thing. And we're going to come back and take a look at what these results look like. Okay, we're back and it says we found a thousand results, results saved to marketinggroups.csv. So we're going to, I stepped away for a while, so uh, we got this message coming up, but our file should be okay if it says we have a thousand groups. Uh, I believe a thousand, I, I was, wasn't sure if it was a thousand or uh, 1500 groups that would turn up. It looks like we may have possibly been logged out of LinkedIn, but let's see what we have here in the file. So marketinggroups.csv. <clears throat> Gonna open that up. And here it is. So 
we will open it everything's like it was all right so here we have the group URL the number of members the group name number of members the group name the group description and the number of discussions and I think that's all I get to for you yeah so we have uh, all that so we have the number of members so you can always sort by this column so if you want to sort from greatest to least uh, or you can sort however you want it's a spreadsheet so just do what you want with it number of discussions and let's see how many results we have uh, da, 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 da. 1001 plus uh, so that's a thousand so and these are all marketing groups like we were searching for content marketing Asia Alliance inbound marketing marketing community jobs marketing so and looks like we go from I think a million down to 122 members that's 179 million members down to 122 members so that's a thousand results for marketing groups so with this you can now one thing that you want to keep in mind is that LinkedIn only allows you to join 50 groups they have a very low limitation uh, so I guess they figure that's the most that people can really handle uh, if they're not using a software like ours so they allow you to join 50 groups so it's important for you to if you wanted to use the software to join groups you can do that I put that functionality in there but I really advise you to choose wisely which groups you want to join because you can only belong to 50 so joining 50 groups is something that you could really do by hand if you wanted to but you can do it in the software I'm going to show you how to do that but keep in mind you can only join belong to 50 so uh, you in order to if there's if you get capped off at 50 if you reach that limit you're gonna have to uh, leave some groups before you can join more so just keep that in mind now I'm gonna show you what we can do what else we can do with uh, well where where are we we're doing the leaked search right now so let's see I'm gonna have to restart this because I got logged out of uh, logged out of you of, of LinkedIn so I'm gonna restart the software and from there we're going to go through the other features so let's I'll end this video and then we'll start another video